It's your boy, Hobie Press 12. And uh, I want to talk about something that I always wanted to talk about today. Uh, what I want to talk about is games. Let's talk about some games today. All right. Uh, good morning to you. First things first. It's back to school season. As you all know, a lot of kids went back to school either yesterday or today. So to all the YouTubers who went back to school, enjoy your first day back to school. And uh, some of, to some of the guys who I've started working with, I'll see y'all on the weekends. You know, we'll do our thing on the weekends. But on the other hand, on the other note, let's talk about some video games today. And I want to talk about I want to talk about the very first game that I played, the very, 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 very first game I played, right, to, to, uh, what's popping to me right now, for me right now, like, what games I'm looking forward to playing coming up soon or in the near future or what I always go back to, what game I always go back to when I don't feel like playing nothing on the, um, like, on the regular. So... As far as I can remember, the very first game that I ever played was Pac-Man on the Atari and Donkey Kong. Those are the very first games that I've ever played. And I was more fixated on Donkey Kong because I was like, yo, I could never get to the top where Donkey Kong was. I could never get up there, but I'll play this game. I played the crap out of this game. I remember I used to climb up on the ladders and let the barrels roll past me. And then as soon as the barrels roll past, I keep moving up. Or I wait for the barrels to pass the top of me and I move up. And then I jump over the barrels and I keep on making my way up. I mean, I don't even remember if I've ever be beaten that game. But I know, you know, as the stages go by, they change colors and stuff like that. And the the more colors the more colors the stage change the harder the game gets. So uh, I remember trying to save the princess or the or, or your little girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Donkey Kong back in the day was 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 the shiznicks. Now all these car the new new Donkey Kong that came out and what's not. It's they are I I mean it's basically trying to upgrade it to the to the um to the consoles that's out there right now. But I think the best one was back in the day when you used to play it on the Atari or or on the NES back in the day. So that was a very that was a very very first game. I played Pac-Man before. I was never really a Pac-Man fan, but you know, Pac-Man it is what it is, you know. I mean, uh, I remember I used to go in a corner and wait in a corner and do like the the double tap back and forth back and forth to try to shimmy off the 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 the, the ghost from catching me. And or wait and sit next to the pebble, the power pebble in the corner and try to eat it. Eat the crap out of them them little ghosts. You know. Uh so yeah, those are my those are my very first two video games I ever remember playing was Pac-Man and Donkey Kong. So next um uh, was Nintendo NES. That was like the next console I went to was the Nintendo NES. Um I never went to like um, the regular Nintendo when they had, what you call it, when they had the gun and the robot, I never really, I never really played that, that system, that console, I totally bypassed that, I just went straight to the NES, on the NES, my top game on the NES was the very first Mortal Kombat and the very first Street Fighter, those are the two games I used to play on that joint, and then it was some street racing game. The, almost like Gran Turismo today, but I forgot what they called it back then. So that was those are the other three games that I played on the system back in the day. You know what I'm saying? Um, what else? Now moving forward to moving forward to um the Playstations and the Xbox and what's not. My game on the PlayStation. Two. I mean, I played on PlayStation One. Uh, PlayStation One to me, the PlayStation One games. There were only the only best games to me on the PlayStation One games was like 
the RPG games. You know what I'm saying? Those are the very like like I'll play like um what you call it? Um Um what's this guy's name? Oh frigate. Um what is the game that I used to play? S um Spiral. Spiral is one. Uh friggin' um that plastic what's that? Plastic Army, um, oh, I forgot the name of that one. That the Army Plastic Joint, um, with the little green men, the, the little plastic army toys, toy soldiers. Yeah, that. And there was another game I used to play on that joint too. Um, Crash Bandicoot. That was one of my favorite joints on the PlayStation One. Um, oh, how can I forget this? Metal Gear, Metal Metal Gear Solid, and um, and I think that was it. That was it. Those are the games that I really played on the PlayStation One. But really, on the PlayStation Two, my real jump off on the PlayStation Two. The only game I used to play on the PlayStation Two was uh, NBA Live, uh, football, NBA Live. NBA football, NBA football, wow, um, live, I think, the, I think Madden was on that joint too, it was a football game that I, 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 I'm trying to remember the game, I'm not, I'm not sure if it was Madden or not, but it was Madden, if it was Madden, it was Madden, a football game, I can't remember the game right now, and, uh, so calm, <laughs> so calm, that was the I was mostly playing SOCOM. You hear me? That multiplayer online joint was crazy for me. Uh, I went from on PlayStation 2 to PlayStation 3, SOCOM in it, out. That was like my top game. But then on PlayStation 3, there um, more titles came into play for me. But I mostly played SOCOM. In the PlayStation era, when I was, that's when I was on PlayStation Hardbody. Matter of fact, I was on PlayStation more frequent than any other console that I ever had. Um, I was on there like at least ten years straight, and um, I mean, the multiplayer for SoCom was crazy. I had like a couple of favorite maps. One with the one with the um, the desert. Wow, that was my map right there, desert. You had to jump over the wall, not jump over the wall, you literally can't jump over the wall, but you used to snipe from all the way back in the, far back in the deep corner of the desert, right there, over by, um, what down was it? I know the B down was right there in the middle by the building, I think A down was over there by the, by the top of the, um, by the top of, top of the mountains, so it would have been over there, right there, by the little bunker, over there in a the deep back, the bunker used to be right here. And the deep back right there, that's where we used to snipe. We snipe right down in the bunker. We used to snipe from there across over to the A down. Yo, that map was crazy. I that was one of my best maps. So calm, boy. I can remember that joint for real, for real. Um, only thing is when it got like the So Calm series, I didn't really like it when it came when it like when it did So Calm Four. That's when it's. Between SOCOM 2, 3, those in there, 2, 3, those were the best ones. 1, 2, and 3, I would say. Then SOCOM on the PlayStation. The PlayStation, um, the PSP. Excuse me. Uh, yeah, so on the PSP, SOCOM on there. Those were good. The PSP version was good, too. Um, and, uh, what you call it? Yeah, I mean, then on the PS on the PS3, I didn't really like the SoCons that came on after that. And after that, uh, I jumped on to, I jumped on to right after SoCon, I would have say it would be Call of Duty. I think it was, I think it was Modern Warfare 2 that I jumped on. Wasn't really too hard body back then for Modern Warfare, so I went from. Uh, my my gun my first person shooter right in that era between SOCOM and Modern Warfare I think I was still more hard body SOCOM player so I went back 
2 playing SOCOM 2 and SOCOM 3 instead of SOCOM 4 doing the multiplayer online I didn't really like the multiplayer of no, SOCOM 4 multiplayer online I wasn't really so I just kept I stuck with SOCOM 2 but then it was a lot of hacks and it was crashing on the time so I had to start playing and then to play more sports so I got into more Madden I got into more uh what you call it basketball NBA live and then God of War God of War took it over for me and that, that was on PlayStation 3. So it was God of War, uh, NBA Live, and SOCOM on PlayStation 3. Those are like my main three games. Then until after like the network was, um, PlayStation Network went down, it was it. It was a wrap for me. It was Xboxing it out from ever since then. And on Xbox, as y'all all know, Call of Duty was my joint from then on. Call of Duty... Uh, and NBA Live, Madden, and uh, and that was pretty much it. Uh, my games now, and Black Ops, Black Ops, yeah, on PlayStation. Um, between uh, SoCal and and Call of Duty, I would have to say the game that took it for me in between that in that transfer area for me too was Black Ops. So it was Black Ops on the PlayStation 3 and uh, Black Ops on, on Xbox. Um, so yeah, now what I'm looking forward to playing coming up between from right now until the end of the year, I already have pre-ordered uh, Borderlands 2. That's what I'm looking forward to. Resident Evil 6, looking forward to that. Uh, NBA Live, NBA 2K13. Uh, uh, wifey supposed to purchase Madden for me, so I'm gonna jump on that Madden again. Uh, also Black Ops Two, definitely Black Ops Two. I'm looking for them zombies, man. Zombies is crazy. Of uh, what else? I am I missing any other games? Da, 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 any other games? I think that's it. Borderlands, Resident Evil Six, Black Ops Two. NBA 2K13. Oh. Something out of the norm for me. But I'm going to try it anyway. Just Dance. Just Dance on um, 4. I'm going to try that out. Get that connect going up. And uh, I think that's about it. So anyway. I'm going to wrap up this vlog. 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 I'm bugging out today, y'all. Yeah, like I said, this is basically about talking about video games. You know what I'm saying? So I want to know what what myself, what my people think. What's their favorite games? I want to know what's your back in the day game. What was your favorite game from back in the day? What is your game in the middle? In the middle of, of all the consoles, you're transitioning. Looked from if you was an Atari fan, I want to know what's your favorite Atari game. Uh, back in the NA, NES days. What was your favorite game or what your favorite console between the NES days and now? Uh, because, you know, you got your NES, you got your Nintendo, you got your Super Nintendo, and then you got your, um, your, your Dreamcast, your Sega Dreamcast and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? So what was your favorite console in between the middle the middle ages and until you get to the new stage? And what do you think about the, um, the next-gen consoles that's coming out? Yo, leave your, your comments in the description. What's your favorite game from back in the day? What was your favorite console between the um, Atari's series all the way up to like your, your Super NES? Those um, those consoles between them. What's your favorite game between the PlayStation Two to the PlayStation Three? You know what I'm saying? Because there's no PlayStation Four. What's your favorite games between that series and the same thing from your Xbox to your Xbox 360s? I want to know what's all your favorite games between each one of those um, errors. Those, um, yeah, basically those errors. And what is what are you looking for at the end of the season coming between now and Christmas? What are your favorite games that you're looking uh, looking forward to play? So leave your information down in the comments. Also, give this video a like. If you're new to the channel, please sub to the channel. Don't forget IOV Nation. IOV, check us out on IOV. Um, we'll be posting a video up on there soon. Uh, and also, I got the Minecraft, baby. I finally downloaded my Minecraft this morning, so 
Wendy Love, I'm looking for you, baby girl. I'm looking for you to teach me a little something. Freedom Fires, holla at your boy. I know you say you're not really doing nothing really, but I want y'all. I'm a new too, son. And um, Fusion Elite, I saw your I saw your page, son. I saw your um your gameplay. You got some serious thing. And oh, one last thing before I go. Um, if y'all didn't check it out, my boy, Mr. Um Tony Starks. He got this thing going on with his uh, Minecraft world. He got a crazy, oh my gosh. Talking about an elite builder, this dude is all, yo, Megatron to me, son. Megatron. Anyway, go check his um, go check his YouTube page out. He has um, links in the description. I'll put a link in the description, but check his page out and look for his Minecraft series. He has that. If you're a comic book fan, Marvel comic book fan, go check that out. Definitely has his Minecraft world is is crazy. Um, he's releasing a, a beta website for his Minecraft world, um, and he's gonna need help maintaining that. Yo, Mr. Tony Starks already got you on the um on the donations. Queenie twenty nine and myself and Fuge and um Soul Fusion Productions as well as Too Much Clues will be donating. To the cause to help you out to uh, maintain that, and when I get better, eventually I will um excuse me, I will um come over and try to do a little something something over there. But yes, please check out Mr. Tony Mr. Tony Socks page, YouTube page. Look for his Minecraft series, uh, Marvel Marvel DC comic area, and check out the um his world, um his videos that he has posted on his channel based on that anyway don't want to make this too long it's your boy obi press 12 with another vlog vlog thursdays yo make sure you like i said check out my boy mr tony stocks uh look out for my minecraft videos coming over the weekend uh also um keep it locked back to school for y'all kids do what y'all gotta do stay focused in school um and that's all I got to say, y'all. I'm trying to keep it positive, trying to keep it moving. It's your boy, Obi Press 12, saying have a good day, and I'm going to holler at y'all later. Peace.